So in all the customer examples we just went through, there was a very strong requirement for development tools that would help in the integration of all the components, subsystems, and other devices into a coordinated and functional machine. Now we'd like to talk to you about some of NI's latest developments for integrating machine vision, motion control, with networking and synchronization. And to help me do that, please welcome Jeff Adair and Christian Fritz. Morning, guys. Morning. Morning. As everybody in this room experiences in this everyday job, the world, and the problems engineers need to solve are getting more complex. Tackling the increased sophistication of applications like wind harvesting or controlling thousands of actuators require tools that allow us to implement powerful distributed control systems. With LabVIEW 2010, National Instruments introduces NI Time Sync, a technology that automatically synchronizes the clocks of NI real-time systems, which can be used to correlate events with structures like the time loop. So as I understand it, with the new NI Time Sync, we can now synchronize these loops on different targets, but there's no additional hardware and no additional software? That's correct. Engineers and scientists can continue to use the time loop as they have in the past, and NI Time Sync will constantly adjust the system clocks of the real-time controllers, keeping them synchronized. John, a lot of customers have been waiting for tools that simplify the development of distributed control applications. And I know you are eager to see this technology in action. Absolutely. So what we have here are two synchronized NI real-time systems. The NI Compact Rio system, with its measurement capabilities, is connected to two digital sensors mounted to this Nerf gun. The NI Embedded Vision system, in the back of our demo, uses two cameras to follow the dart on its path to the target. Because both systems are tightly synchronized using NI Time Sync, we can easily measure the speed as well as the time it takes the dart to hit the target. Now, John, you went to the University of Texas, right? That's right. We're not going to get another Nebraska joke, are we? No, BYU Cougar here. <laughs> but since you're a real Texan, you should have no problem hitting this target. Why don't you give it a try? All right. <laughs> Just go for the red target there, Go right? for it. OK, another, give me another shot. <laughs> sure. <sighs> well, I, I don't know if we have time for several hundred additional practice shots. <laughs> Jeff, do you think we can give John some support? Sure. John, today we're pleased to announce a new LabVIEW 2010 NI soft motion module and new EtherCAT drives and motors. These new products allow customers to build scalable motion control solutions and deploy them from Windows-based PCs to embedded real-time systems. Using those brand new products, all available from National Instruments, we implemented a vision-guided motion application. NI soft motion enables us to implement the motion control on the same control system and directly send the position commands to the distributed drives using deterministic EtherCAT communication. Jeff, why don't you activate the drives and John, you can give it one more try. <laughs> All right, are we ready? Go for it. Now that LabVIEW is helping you aim, TimeSync is synchronizing the clocks of the industrial controller and the compact Rio, allowing us to calculate the speed of the dart. A travel time of about 50 kilometers per hour gives us less than 100 milliseconds to adjust the position of the target. OK, but obviously my shooting, my aim warmed up, so I didn't really challenge your machine a whole lot. Is there anything we could do to up the challenge? We thought you might ask that. Why don't you try this one? It shoots just a little bit faster. My boys are going to want one of these. <laughs> All right, are we ready? It's ready. <laughs> Woohoo! Woo. I feel like Rambo. <laughs> Guys. All right, Get great demonstration of our ability to integrate uh, multiple uh, real-time systems. You demonstrated the new uh, NI TimeSync and the new EtherCAT motors and drives. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks, Christian. Thank you. Thank you.